Hello, Maniac, and welcome to another episode of Maniac Mornings. I'm your host, Caitlin, and I'm here to fill you in on all the news and events happening the rest of this holiday season in Maniac. Have you had a chance to pick up the Dogs of MNYK calendar yet? It's 14 full months of four-legged celebrities owned by Maniac business owners and local residents. You can pick up a copy at select locations on Main Street for $15, with $10 of the proceeds going to Red Paws Emergency Relief Fund. All photos were shot by Alexa Nehas Photography, and you can find more information on where to pick up these calendars at Maniac.com. And the best of Maniac is back this year with 51 categories in Live, Shop, Dine, and Play. Vote for your favorite businesses and people now through December 31st by following the link on Maniac.com's Facebook page. Winners will be announced in the Best of Maniac issue coming out this March, and join us for the Best of Maniac party coming this March too. And we're still accepting clean clothes and winter accessories now through the end of the year for Advent's Thanks for Giving Clothing Drive. All clothes collected will be donated to North Lake Community Center and Impact Thrift Stores. A list of drop-off locations can be found on Facebook at Thanks for Giving Philly. And our Maniac businesses are giving back in a big way again this year for our Maniac Meals and More program. Maniac restaurants will be making over 900 hot meals to be delivered this Sunday, December 18th to those in need. Our Maniac retailers have also been collecting canned goods and non-perishable food items all over Main Street, and you still have a few days to get some more items into those boxes to be delivered this Sunday to those in need. More details can be found at Maniac.com for a list of participating retailers. And Sweet Elizabeth will be hosting a Kids Craft Day tomorrow from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. They'll provide the supplies and you bring the creativity. Don't forget to place your holiday orders too. Sweet Elizabeth will be offering the Boost de Noel, Holiday Wreath Cake, Shimmer and Sparkle Cake, and the 2017 Cake with Champagne Soaked Strawberries. And bring your little elves tomorrow also to Pineapple on Main for PJs and popcorn. Enjoy an evening of holiday movies, drinks, and snacks, and prizes will be awarded to the family in the most festive holiday pajama set. Also, all weekend long at Pineapple on Main, it's a weekend of joyful giving. Monetary donations will be accepted to create emergency assistance baskets for those in need. And Leo sitting on the couch now with Winnie Clowry of Winnie's La Bus and Smoke and John's Barbecue, our gracious hosts of Manian Corning. Thank you, Caitlin. I'm sitting here today with Winnie Clowry of Winnie's La Bus and our home base of Smoke and John's. Winnie, welcome to the couch. Hello, Leo. <laughs> Thank you. How are you doing today? I'm doing pretty good. Thank pretty you good. on this rainy day. Yeah, it is what it is. Yes, it is. <laughs> So uh, what made you come down to Maniunk in the first place? Well, I came to work um, at La Bus at the time, next door, in 1994. I've left for a certain amount of time to do different things for La Bus, but then my husband and I came back in 2003 and purchased the restaurant off of David Braverman. Mm -hmm. What are some of your personal favorites over at Winnie's? Right now, my favorite is the kale salad. Okay. Probably because it's a healthy choice and um, as opposed to the lobster mac and cheese, which I truly love, but I have to limit myself on it all of the time. Guilty pleasure? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> what made you open up a second restaurant right next door? I uh, had always said I was going to have another location or uh, another business opportunity and it seemed to be a good fit for me. So what are the um, keys to success for keeping a restaurant standing for so long, just like Winnie's? I believe in marketing to our neighborhood, and I know so many people that come in, um, they're a, a regular clientele that are so supportive of me, and I really appreciate it. So Winnie, where is the best place on Main Street to get brunch? I would have to think it's definitely my place. You when sure about that? <laughs> Absolutely, hands down, the best place to get brunch. What, uh, what's the best uh, selling brunch item on your menu? I myself like the um, frittata. It's an open-faced omelet and blueberry six-grain pancakes. I love them. I think we have the best sausage in the world. And my sister Tara, who's a bartender on brunch, would say, Bloody Mary, Winnie. Tell them about the Bloody Marys. So there you go, that's it. Bloody Marys, pancakes, <laughs> frittatas, they got it all. Uh, Winnie, thank you so much thank for having you. us here Thanks in your so. restaurant. Uh, we're gonna now send it to Caitlin, who's over at Threads on Main for this week's store tour. Take it away, Caitlin. Thanks, Leo. I'm down here at Threads on Main for this episode's store tour. Owner Anna Purcell opened the space just this past fall in the old location of the Little Apple and people are already falling in love with her threads. 
So Anna, tell us how Threads on Main got its start. So I kind of knew I always wanted to own a women's clothing boutique and I started looking around spaces here and there and I actually overheard Brandy of Little Apple having a conversation at Christie's Nails and I said not to like be rude and overhear you but is your space going for lease and she said yes and that's how it started. So what made you want to come to Maniunk then? Um, I went to St. Joe's so I've been living here in Maniunk for a couple years now and we really just love the little main street. It's so cute. And I was like oh it could really use some clothing stores. It has great restaurants, great gift shops and I felt like this was the perfect place to open. So have you always had a love for fashion? Yes, I have. Ever since I was a little girl, I love to style people, put them together. And so over the years, I've realized that I can now shop. I do all of the buying myself, and I love having people come in. I put outfits together to make them feel stylish and confident and ready for either work, a night out, like a fun wedding event, anything. So tell us about some of the designers you have in the shop and what are some of your favorite pieces here. We have anything really from Michael Stars, which are wonderful t-shirts that you literally have for a million years. Um, for denim, we carry DL, which has like a really great universal fit. Hudson, which always has some really great distressing and is really a comfortable denim. We do Current Elliott, which is like your true denim, has like a really good feel to it. We also carry Amanda Uprichard, which is like great going out tops, little generation love. Lots of stuff. And some great white, white and worn cashmere sweaters. My favorite item in the shop is probably this little Parker dress. It's perfect for the holidays. And I think people will wear it for years and years and years. So for those that are looking to come in and shop here for the holidays, what are some gift suggestions that you recommend? I would definitely recommend looking at some of our cashmere sweaters. Um, scarves are a really great gift to give. We also have these really cute mantra bands that are sterling silver, rose gold, and gold, and they have little sayings on them. Um, we also have some cute little crossbody bags and clutches and things like that, which are nice gift giving items. So this has been your first holiday here on Main Street as a retail business. How has it been? It's been really great. It's really fun that everyone decorates for the holidays and people are really in the holiday spirit. A lot of people are coming in asking for holiday outfits, things they need for little cocktail parties and holiday get together. So it's been really fun to dress people for the holidays when you're a little bit more looking to dress up and a little bit more festive. Well, thanks for having us today, Anna, and giving us a tour of the shop. Thanks for stopping in. And if you want to get something for a special holiday occasion or find something for someone on your list, stop by Threads on Main. Thanks for joining us for another episode of Maniunk Mornings. This episode wrapped up season one, but come back for season two starting in January 2017. Special thanks to Winnie, who's hosted us here at Smokin' John's all season long, and hopefully we'll be up again next season. Megan, who's our producer for the episode. Leo, who's another anchor with me. And Terry from Terry Leahy Films, who produces all these episodes and is behind the scenes on the camera. In the meantime, until you meet us back here in January, we hope you all have a happy holiday and come back to Main Street soon. Happy holidays. Happy. <laughs>